chips it up. Gorn sets himself. Three to beat. Jones at the back. So Hogan against Wits. Wits the tap. Petrarca looked to run onto it. Miller makes space for Harbrow. Handball misses Leslie. Garlett. Oliver. Snap. Another. Knocked free. Here's Tyson. Feeds it back to Salem. Gets a look from 48 metres. Front and centre for Young. Tries to stand up in the tackle. But three come at him. It spills out. Quick snap from Holman. It's good. Clayton somehow just got a little separation. Jay Kennedy Harris runs by. He's ignored. Here's a chance for Spargo. He doesn't break stride. Bang! Demons have got five. Now Garlett can put it out into the path of Hogan. He's got a couple of metres on Max Spencer. Spencer closes. Hogan twisting and turning. Looking for an option. Garlett kept running. He delivered it originally from half back. Garlett will square it up in the McDonald direction. It'll clear him. Spills to the back. Petrarca. Spargo. Champagne football D's. The big injury concern from earlier was Peter Wright. You can see there just hyperextends that knee. He is ruled out for the rest of the afternoon. So one player down here for the Gold Coast Suns. Archie tumbles it, chance for Young, just slaps it in front and they're off to the races here, a chance for Heron, just arches his back, starts to run, off he goes, got the speed but got run down. Here's Lewis from 48 metres, just pops it up to a two on one, they got in each other's way, Vandenberg lurking, turning, trying to get a handball off to Harms, he does, and he goes. Young's got to stand and wait, tackle comes from Vince. Ball released. Fiorini and Fritsch go at it. It comes to Weller. Now Sexton. Gold Coast get their second. Dropped a fair bit of weight this summer so he could get more mobile around the ground and hasn't lost anything in his ruck work at stoppages. 5.4 Ks on Max Gorn's Telstra tracker. Here's Leslie. It's going to bounce through, is it? It is. Fiorini. And Leslie's offered something across half forward this afternoon. He's presented well, and on this occasion, delivers inside 50 to Sexton, who can go back and kick for his third goal. Well, remarkably, Alex Sexton could be the leading goal kicker on the ground if he slots this. From 48 metres, finishes beautifully. Three goals to Sexton. The Suns get their fourth. Now they've got men open in the forward 50, sneaking in over the back. That's a big fly and a nice mark taken by Weller. He had the sit. He can pop it over the top. And some reward for effort here. Coming up for the Suns as Sexton will go back to kick for his fourth. <laughs> Chance for the Ds. Spencer needs to hold up. Risk it till under enormous pressure. Spargo's a tackler. Demons come from everywhere. Crowd on their feet. Phillies boots. Oh. Well done in the end. Lemons reeled it in. They kicked 100 plus eight Play times on. total. But an attacking force this year, the number one attack in the game. And they're attacking again. Lone man is Jesse Hogan. It's kicked in his direction. Garlett's going to be fed the ball into the goal square, into the third deck. He works it through the middle. Got a couple of demons to choose. Play short. Play Started the last goal from about here. Sent it over the top to Hogan, who gave it to Gullet this time. McDonald, one hand! Bends at Goldwood. Miller comes across. It's still bouncing. It's still alive. And Sexton's kicked his fifth. A long ball to the one-on-one. -on -one. Can Hogan get to the contest? He can. Spencer did well. Knocked it towards the man in Bose who almost has it stolen as he caught holding the ball. Demons fans want it. They want a goal too and they might get it. Hogan to Harms to goal. Quick response. Goal 17 for Melbourne. 52 metres. Punches it low towards the square. And Hogan read the cue beautifully. 
there's some less than good news for the D's. Joel Smith lands awkwardly there on that right shoulder AC joint. Play will be stopped. Jetta crashes on through. Brody couldn't hold on to him. Petrarca fed it. Jay Kennedy Harris. Here's the one on one. Hogan Spencer. Big, tall, and strong. Jesse Hogan looking for four. Inside 50, Spargo will go. Can he control the football? He can. Works it. It's going to be a shot late. Perhaps after the siren. As a young kid, you're throwing the ball to yourself. Siren's gone this to win by 100. So the mate, youngster, wearing the famous number, it's drifted late. No 100-point win, but the consolation prize for the first time in the club's history, they win three by 90-plus in the one season.